Hello, everyone. I'm Andrea Fujii. And I'm Peter Dowd. An out of control pickup driver crashes all the way into a gym just moments after a class happened to end early. The driver crashed into the Real Fitness Gym in Playa del Rey at Pershing Drive in Campbell Street. Christy Fajardo was at the scene with dramatic video of the crash you'll only see on KCAL 9. Christy. Yeah, and Peter, when you see that video, you'll understand why it took all day to board up and shore up this wall. You'll also see why the owners of the gym are actually grateful the holiday weekend meant business was slow. Not cardio, but this scene sent hearts racing in Playa del Rey. Here's another angle. Security video from Real Fitness shows the impact, the pickup, and a gym full of debris and dust. Is there any warning? No warning at all. Uh, again, it was just my, my own business, and I just hear this big bang, and it sounded like an explosion went off. And uh, I turn, and there's a truck just right there through the wall. That's Wesley Bixler moving at the top of the screen as the Mitsubishi makes its entrance. Seconds later, good Samaritans rush through the hole in the wall to check on people in the gym and the driver. It looked like he was okay. From the looks of it, he looked like he was banged up with a few scratches and bruises, but nothing too crazy. Inside, everyone was okay too. This is the view from outside. Police believe at about 9 Saturday morning, the driver of the Mitsubishi was on Manchester, approaching Pershing when he lost control. And despite all of this damage, the gym's owners and trainers feel lucky. And normally we have around 15, 16 people at that time. And because it's the holidays, we had a couple only show up and we ended class early. A fluke of timing that left hearts pumping. But no heartbreak. I mean, you saw in the video, I was just standing there, amazed at what had just happened. Crews just finished boarding up this wall about a half hour ago. The gym's owners tell us it appears their 35 year old driver had some sort of medical emergency while he was driving. Police tell us they took him to the hospital to be checked out just in case, but say at this point, it does not appear he'll be facing any charges. Back to you. All right.